Hello, Leo, and welcome to another reading with me, Soulful. How are you guys doing today? Okay, so I had a pretty intense Sagittarius reading. Um, there seems to be some very thick energy in the air with the fire signs today. Um, and I am really hoping that we get into something a little more positive here. But if we don't, I'll still deliver the messages. You know I will. But let's see what we have for you, Leo. How are you guys doing today? Are you doing well? <laughs> I just want to give a heads up uh, to you guys that I'm on Thursday. I will be closing my personals for a while because I'm going on a trip and uh, I will be busy for a little while, but don't worry, I'll still be putting out content and things like that. But um, yes, 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 yes. We want to get you a reading. Okay, you guys know how this works. Not every reading is going to resonate with all of the Leos in the Leo Collective, okay? Check your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. Those may resonate more for you on my channel or other channels on YouTube. Feel free to subscribe. I'm giving you the advertisement. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's get into this. What does Leo want to hear today? What does Leo... Oh, this is Scully. Yep, we're calling it Scully. We're going with Scully. Okay. Let's see. I love the X-Files, so... Knight of Wands in reverse. We just had this energy in the Sagittarius reading. <laughs> okay, let's get some more. It was Page of Wands, actually. Uh, Queen of Swords in reverse. What is going on, Leo? What is going on? I don't like this. There is some nasty communication going on right now for you and somebody else. And then Page of Cups. Okay. Um, I feel like some of you are dealing with an air sign, possibly a female. If it's not a female, it is um, someone embodying the feminine aspects more in their energy. Okay. Uh, you know what? I think you are having a fight with somebody. That's what I think, Leo. You are in conflict with someone. We'll find out more with the cards here. And it is, you know, you wish that that wasn't happening because I think you may actually have emotion or feelings for whoever this is that you're in conflict with. They may be coming off incredibly cold to you right now and just not communicating in a way that is beneficial for both of you to work together. Okay, Leo. And um, I like that. <laughs> but that's just my opinion. Uh, yeah, you know what? I, I want to I wanna get into this. I want to get, I want to get into this. Stop shuffling my cards over here like a mad person. Okay, tell me about the Knight of Wands. Ooh, you know what? We need to shuffle these puppies first. We got to get that energy out of there. That's right, huh, Scully? We got to get, get that energy. I don't know if you guys, I mentioned it in another video. If you've ever seen the show Dresden Files, a really good show. Go check it out. There was a guy named Bob who lived in a skull on Dresden. He was a wizard. He's a wizard. Uh, it's a, um, what's it called? Urban fantasy sort of setting. Okay. Tell me about the Knight of Wands in reverse. Tell me about the Knight of Wands in reverse here, Leo. Ooh, King of Wands in reverse energy. Oh my goodness. You really are having a hard time, aren't you? Um, there's someone here. I just get a vibe that really is just, you're not jiving with. Okay. And they are, they are cold. Okay. I feel this person is really cold and cutting with their words and you're fighting fire with air. Um, you know what I mean? Okay. Magician. <laughs> Some of you are freaking smart as a whip. Um, I think that maybe Leo, you're, you're, uh, you're just, did I say Sagittarius earlier? I meant Leo. You, you could have Sag in your chart, but you know, you're trying to make this situation go in your favor. I feel you're definitely going through some uh, tongue jousting here. I want to say, uh, yeah, like I said, you're in conflict with this person, but you, s somebody here has emotions or needs to open up the emotional communication properly with that page of cups. Ten of swords in reverse. E yeah. Oh man, did not expect that one. Whoever this is that you're communicating with, 
okay? One of you is really hurt about something from the past. Uh, could be you, could be them. And this is what's causing a divide between both of you. Someone feels betrayed to a really massive extent. Could be you. But you're trying to change the situation here. You're trying to change the outcome. You're using all the tools that you have to change it. Okay. Let's take a look here. Tell me about the... Let's have a look at our Queen of Swords. They're in your energy and I feel it. They're like just in it. So whoever this is, this is an active engagement. Two of Cups in reverse. Oi, 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 oi. So yeah. <laughs> we have a definite problem here with a relationship that is a possible soulmate. Soul tie. You guys are fighting. You may have just broken up or you're about to separate. You could be in separation and you guys are fighting a lot and you want this betrayal to feel better. Yes, as I say that, Ace of Cups, okay, you still have feelings and you want to heal this. You want to heal this situation with them. You want a new beginning or they want a new beginning in love with you, but somebody is just not expressing it. Instead, all of the past garbage is getting in the way of this moving forward. One more. Yep, Three of Cups in reverse. It's like, uh, you know, I really want this, but what about the pain of the past? You know, what about how we broke up? What about the way we separated? It doesn't feel good to me. I don't want this. It feels nasty. But you guys, you know, one of you really has emotion and they may be the one who has emotions here. They may be hiding with a cold exterior here, you know, there's layers to tarot readings. It's not just one flat layer, okay? Um, this person may be hiding the fact that they want a new start with you because they're wrapped up in what happened in the past in the breakup. And then here with the Ten of Swords, you felt betrayed, they felt betrayed, and they can't move on, okay? This is kind of a, a prison of its own making in a sense. Let's go ahead and ask about the Page of Cups. You guys need to, to, to reconnect. This is what I feel. Tell me about the Page of Cups, please. Strength in reverse. Someone has not got the balls to step up to the plate or the cojones or the lady cojones. I don't know. Whatever you want to call it. It doesn't matter to me. Um, <laughs> uh, somebody here is... Uh, <sighs> really not able to do it. Like they just don't feel as though it will work out. And here's you again. Knight of Wands, but in the upright. I feel, uh, God, why do I keep thinking Sagittarius? This is Leo, 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 Scully, Leo. Okay. I feel like it's going to be you that expresses it first. If you do express to this person how you feel, okay, that, that you want this new start. You may be kind of wanting to, why do I get this strong, I really a strong sense of, of attraction towards them that you can't let go of. It's just like this pull that you have towards them and uh, you really want to express it to them. You want to open up the lines of communication, but you're dealing with someone who is just like, no, no, I don't have a heart. I don't want to talk about this. You know, I don't want to get in the emotional realm. Why would I want to do that? Why would I want to heal? Even though that's what they really want. Um, let's go ahead and get one more. We have the four of wands. Oh, garbage man's here. Four of wands. Okay. You know, Leo, uh, there's happiness here. There is. And I feel you want it. You want passion. You want joy. You want to dance with this person under the sunset, okay? <laughs> and they are stopping this new beginning from happening with both of you because they are hung up on the, either the breakup or the pain from the past, all right? And that is up to you what you want to do. Let's pull three more cards, and then we're going to pull some oracle cards, and we'll get into the extended and definitely explore this some more. Tell me about this energy here of the past betrayal. Tell me about this past betrayal, please, for Leo. Tell me about the past betrayal for Leo. Wheel of Fortune. 
that started, uh, you know, whatever the pain was, okay, one of you got over it. I feel like maybe it was them or you. I, somebody is slightly over it. No, th th there's a turning here, uh, a pace. I feel you're more likely to actually forget the past than this person is with a little fortune here and create something new. You want to create something new. Okay, and you have the backing of uh, the Wheel of Fortune here. Uh, I also just heard that some of you are really well established with your money, or you just know you you take care of yourself. So that's why you're actually jumping in and exploring this right now again. Uh, this is definitely a past person. Tell me about the Ace of Cups here. Tell me about the Ace of Cups. Lovers. You see what I mean about layers here? You see what I mean about layers in tarot readings? So yeah, this person really, they love you, okay? They love you. I'm here to tell you a little secret about whoever this is. This possible air sign with a feminine energy here. Uh, they, they love you. They want you. But they are being a little bitch, okay? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I need sleep, okay? Don't judge me, guys. I'm, I'm not a hard ass. I just... I'm going through some changes in my life. <laughs> I don't know if you can tell. Um, okay, let's... Scully understands. Scully always understands, you know? Okay, so tell me about the... I want to know about the strength in reverse here. What's this is all about? I feel like somebody can't get, like, has an overwhelming, like, I think it's you. You're really freaking attracted to this person. Like a magnet. Uh, Ace of Pentacles in reverse. All right. So you're attracted to the person who doesn't want to give. It's kind of like those anime characters, you know, that run away from what they actually want. Funny story about that. It's something I sent my sister the other day, but... It's like that person that runs away from what they really want and they don't know how to accept it. You know, you're given, this may be a missed opportunity this time around for this person. For some of you, you may be kind of getting tired of it a little bit because you know there's something here. Um, but there may be this, re the reason this person isn't offering this to you. Sorry, I can't speak. The reason this person isn't offering this to you at this point in time is because they're being a little bitch. Okay. They just are. I don't like it. Have you guys seen Forrest Siddhartha's channel? I absolutely love her readings because she tells it like it is. <laughs> um, when, when I've watched some of her readings and I'm like, damn, she's harder than I'll ever be. <laughs> if you guys haven't seen her channel, go check her out. Okay. All right. Let's get you guys some readings here. That's where the little beach came from. So, yeah, I'm quoting Forrest Siddhartha's channel here. Let's get you guys some advice. Tell me what advice do we have here for our beautiful, beautiful lions. Okay, don't let this person throw you off your game as well here. Um, because I think you know what to do. You do. All tied up in reverse. Yeah, you know what? You're going to get out of this shit. Like, you're letting go of the pain. You don't want to stay tied up anymore in something that hurts you. Um, but I think this person may be having an issue with that still. Even though they're like, oh my god, I really want Leo. Okay? But keep in mind, this person's heart is closed off. Let's get some, some more here. It's And it, it could very well be a missed opportunity this time around, even though you know there's love here. One more. Happy family in reverse. Yeah, you know, I feel like this person has an issue. Mm hmm They have an issue, and that is not letting themselves be happy. Okay? They are hiding. Let's get one more. They need to reach out. And then we have this appreciation in the reverse. Leo, I'm only going to say this once. Okay. If someone is not appreciating your time or your efforts and giving them the emotions that they want, and then they're just kind of like, whatever, okay, over here doing, you know, hiding how they really feel. Do not let them take advantage of you. 
appreciate yourself for who you are okay just appreciate yourself if they're not appreciating you you're the only one who can do it for yourself even though there could be this missed opportunity here in love okay don't let it change your worth that's what i'm hearing and let's get you one moonology card what advice do we have here someone asked me in one of my readings the other day um or was it yesterday they said how are you so how do you know all these details how are you so accurate how do you know and my answer is obviously scully right <laughs> okay we have surrender to the divine yeah you know you guys know what to do okay you don't need me to tell you what to do next i feel like you know all right, if you want to come explore this with me over on the, 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 the my Patreon, you can see the link to that down below. Six bucks a month gets you access to all of my extended readings, and you can come and explore the rest of this reading with me, and maybe we can get you some advice on how to uh, maybe even get this person to open up. We can, we'll take a look at that, and we're going to also take a look at... Um, this past pain, how to heal it. And then we're going to take a look at how to cope if this is a missed opportunity here. Okay. All right. I will see you guys over in the extended. Bye.